first thing you notice as you move through this part of Kangaroo Island is, is just the utter devastation. It's incredible and it just gives you a bit of an idea of the intensity of the fires that, that really roared through this area in January earlier this year. WF Australia is you know, delighted to be working here on Kangaroo Island uh, and for species such as the Kangaroo Island Dunna, a critically endangered species, a species we don't know very much about. Before the bushfires there was estimated to be fewer than 500 Kangaroo Island Dunnarts across its range on the island. Following the Kangaroo Island bushfires in 2019-20, uh, it was estimated that 96% of that known habitat for Kangaroo Island Dunnarts was affected. We've been setting up uh, drift lines which have uh, which are small fences and at each end we install a, a sensor camera which allows us to record whatever animals might come wandering by and uh, these cameras play an important role because they can basically put eyes in places where the dunnarts might be. Only a small species about the size of a mouse they're very hard to find across a, a large landscape, so it allows us to put hundreds of pairs of eyes across this landscape. Using camera traps to monitor wildlife can be incredibly tedious. You can get hundreds of empty images before you get a few images of that elusive animal. Wildlife Insights is a platform powered by Google's AI technology to identify over 800 species of wildlife in seconds.